New developments this afternoon. The Conyers teenager who got international attention after he rode a bike 50 miles to register for college now has a new set of wheels, and this time there are four of them. Channel 2's Barrett mm -hmm. Peterson is live in Lamar County. And Barrett, you talked to Fred Barley. He also talked about this recent controversy surrounding his whole story. He did. This is Fred Barley's new ride. That is Fred in the driver's seat. No more pedaling around this town. Fred Barley has a new set of wheels. Four wheels. <laughs> that, that felt amazing just the, because of the fact that I know it's mine. Quite the step up from the bicycle, Barley says he pedaled 50 miles from Conyers to Barnesville to register for classes at Gordon State College. Car dealer Andy Ungaro drove this Hyundai all the way from Philly to give it to Fred. I watched the story and looked into it a little bit, and it seemed like it was a real deal. The 19-year-old's tale went viral after police found him living in a tent on campus. But when a local resident set up a GoFundMe account that swelled to $184,000, some began questioning Barley's story. GoFundMe froze the money. But now there's an agreement to set up a trust to ensure the assets would be used to cover Barley's education and living expenses. When it's all done and did, I'll just throw you guys the, the whole draft and trust so everybody could just see what it states on there themselves. Meantime, while he loves the car, Barley says he won't forget what got him here. Uh, the bike's never going away. I'm still going to utilize my bike. Now, Fred acknowledges there are some who doubt that he pedaled that bicycle here all the way from Conyers. He insists he did it, and if those who don't believe, that's up to them. Point live in Lamar County, Baron Peterson, Channel 2 Action. Well, there were certainly some skeptics, but it sounds like he's moving past all of that, and we know he's in school as well, so we wish him uh, continued success, Baron. Thank you.